newcomers to the Late Show who may not know. Yes, yes. Why don't you explain to the people out there who we have an old friend joining old the band friend. tonight. Tell everybody who's sitting with the band tonight, please. Oh, my God. Friend of the show of Corey Wong and the Wong Notes, Corey Wong. Thanks, Corey, Corey Wong. Wong. Good to see you again. Woo. I see you, sir. Old home week. Also, you, you, you start with the Corey Wong. I counter with a Mr. Hugh Jackman is going to be out here in hey. just a little while. Star, stage, Woo. screen. Other things, no doubt. Other <laughs> forms of medium. Uh, quick uh, quit, uh, prod, uh, 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 podcasting plug right here. If you guys enjoy this show on the TV as you're watching it right now, keep in mind you can also enjoy this show on the podcast. That's how Evie listens to it. Oh, really? She does the podcast the next day. She's a busy woman. She doesn't have time for this, <laughs> for this nonsense. She podcasts it while she's doing other things. There you go. If you enjoyed the Prince Harry interview last week, and many of you did, I can tell. Um, <laughs> that, that was a little late. That was a little late. <laughs> uh, but you can, we got a 40-minute version of that on the podcast. Go check it out. And there's more Harry out there. We got another, like, another 10 minutes of Harry, right? We're going to drop that bomb one of these days. You're not going to believe it. You're not going to believe it. Folks, uh, if you watch the show, you know I love tech. Nothing gets me going in the morning like the sound of my modem dialing up all the hottest news. <laughs> Fit to print on my Oki Dada Dot Matrix. America truly is online. And I like to bring you all the latest tech news in my tech segment, Cyborgasm. That opening credit is so long, I thought I'd have a sip of coffee, and I spilled a load of it. First up, <laughs> the annual Consumer Electronics Show just finished, and one of the hottest new innovations is a snore-silencing pillow. Fun fact, every pillow is a snore-silencing pillow <laughs> if you're willing to do the time. Keep that in mind. This smart pillow has a built-in microphone that detects snoring, then triggers soundless airbags that change size to gently turn a sleeper's head. Great for snoring, less so for any other bed activity. <laughs> hey, want to go back to my place? We have to keep it down. <laughs> the pillow is listening. <laughs> the pillow also syncs with a smartphone app and collects data, which is analyzed to identify snoring patterns. Until now, this advanced snore tracking was only possible if you had cutting-edge, sleep-deprived spouse technology. <laughs> if a microphone pillow doesn't sound quite invasive enough, then you'll love a new computer to put in your toilet. It's a disc that hangs inside a toilet bowl, which lets people analyze their urine. And before you judge, the disc is into it. <laughs> Please. The device measures nutritional indicators like vitamin C and ketone levels. Then, based on that information, recommends workouts, dietary suggestions, and recipes. <laughs> honey! Honey, what do you think we should have for dinner? I'm thinking pizza, but the toilet thinks we should get sushi. <laughs> also, also... <laughs> also, it said if we eat Taco Bell again, it's gonna hire the pillow to kill me. And the show also saw the debut of BMW's iVision D concept car that can change colors in seconds using something called e-ink technology. And as you can see from these color choices, it's the perfect car for the Easter Bunny's midlife crisis. <laughs> but that's not all. With its new ability to adapt, the car can even make facial expressions with its grill and headlamps. And is this true? I'm told we have a video simulation. Also, <laughs> you see, now we're not. Now there's no, <laughs> no bump. Also debuting at CES this year, a new device to keep your conversations private while gaming. Take a look. Ah, ah, ah. Quiet.
There you go. <laughs> now that's a look that says, yes, this is totally a sex thing. <laughs> the upsetting device is called the Mutalk because that sounds so much better than Game Gimp. <laughs> Next up. Advancement in robotics research have resulted in a robot called Golfy, being the first to be able to autonomously spot and travel to a golf ball anywhere on a green and sink a putt. Let's take a look at Golfy in action. All right, sees the ball, starts the approach, makes a small adjustment here, moves with a quick turn a little closer. Final approach, almost there. All right, and here it comes. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Finally, a solution to the problem of golf being too fast. <laughs> Finally, Uber Eats has launched a robot delivery service in Miami. Residents can order their Uber Eats takeout to be delivered via autonomous sidewalk trotting robots, or as Florida's alligators call them, sex partners. <laughs> we'll be right back with Hugh Jack.